Google seems to have silently confirmed Android M for its Google I.O. event. Samsung reports unprecedented demand for one of its Galaxy S6 models. And if you want the Apple Watch in stores, it seems you're very close. I'm Jaime Rivera, and I'm not going to brag. I'm going to let the shirt do the talking. This is Pocket Now Daily. The official news that I have to do with Samsung is the company has just manifested how much people are going crazy over buying its gold version of the Galaxy S6. That's the gold platinum variant, by the way. And uh, this is not in every region. This is actually only happening in Europe. Apparently, they've sold 25% uh, of its units are the golden models. They're not providing exact figures of how many units were sold. But uh, yeah, it seems that people are liking this new color. And uh, so much so that they've provided a full press release of why people are following the golden Trend. Links in the description to read that. Other official news have Google's launch of Project Fi. The invites have gone out and uh, people can already test it, so long as they got invited. And this is cool, first of all, because you're getting it, but sadly not everything is great. It seems that services like Google Voice are dying with Project Fi. Those of you that uh, get to use the service will actually have to decline using Google Voice going further. And it seems that it even hinders some portions of Google's Hangout services. And we wonder if that's going to be forever. We will keep you posted as we learn more. And talking about Motorola, we've got official and non-official news. And let's begin with the official ones, as the company has made its uh, Android 5.1 update official, at least in paper. Uh, they have confirmed all the bug fixes that we are getting, etc., etc., but uh, we don't really get any dates. The good thing is we get the press release for all Moto X models, even the old generation one, uh, but uh, we don't have any dates, sadly. Hopefully it'll be better than with Android 5.0. And uh, when it comes to rumors, we've got uh, according to some trusted sources, what we should expect to be the next Moto X, and it seems we've, we're getting a Snapdragon 808, 5.2 inch Quad HD display, 4 gigs of RAM, and other goodies in the links in the description as well. And for those of you that are getting July estimates for the Apple Watch, it seems that uh, Cupertino is already preparing to have the Apple Watch available in stores. Not necessarily for you to walk in and buy one, but uh, uh, the company's website is already prepared to be updated whenever your local Apple Store has as a unit in a way for you to go pick it up in case uh, you want to go for an in-store pickup. It seems that that's the way it's going to be. We sadly don't have any dates as to when that's going to happen, and the fact that this availability is there doesn't necessarily mean that it will happen. It could just be a website update, but uh, hopefully it'll be before July. And finally, for the very hot news of the day, Google has just sent out its schedule for Google I.O. that's happening in the next 21 days. And uh, you'd think that that'd be it. The company within the schedule said, uh, learn how Android M will bring the power of Android to other workplaces. So yeah, even though we didn't know that Android M was coming at Google I.O., the company pretty much teased it. And uh, disclaimer, they pretty much removed that from the schedule now. So it could have been a mistake or it could have been intentional. Whatever the case may be, Android M seems to be coming, and uh, we need it desperately, specifically because of how bad Lollipop handles RAM. But it leads me to the question of the day. What would be your primary wish list for Android M? What would you want? In my case, I want timely notifications on Android, but that could just be me. Leave us a comment down below. What is it that you want? Friends, you know the drill. If you want to get the news earlier before this video is filmed, make sure you follow us on PocketNow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.